So guys, welcome to the Need for Speed No Limits video on my channel. Now, early access to this beta has been provided by EA and Fire Monkeys, and today we're going to be showcasing one of the brand new Hot Wheels DLC vehicles, and it is known as the Gazella GT. Now, we've got a heavily upgraded version to show you guys. Pretty excited to try it out. It's going to be my first impressions. I haven't used this car yet, and uh, yeah, I'm kind of interested to see how it plays out. Maybe it's going to be an interesting one. Maybe it's going to be a fast car. If you guys are new to the channel, I recommend leaving a like and subscribing for future content like this. If you do enjoy the video, then uh, obviously check out the other content. I will be covering a little bit more to do with this update. And uh, if you guys have not played Need for Speed before and you want to try out the game for yourselves and download it, the link below will take you to the download. If not, you can also have a look at what is the full update notes on this brand new Hot Wheels DLC collaboration. It's just down below if you want to click the link. So, I'm going to show you now the car that is part of it. And this is the Hot Wheels Gazella GT. You can see it in my garage there. 788 PR is what is on there. It, it just looks, it looks amazing to say the least. Look, look at that. Top speed of 7,403. Acceleration of 6,060. Nitro of 6,731. Now, I haven't done anything else to the car. This is what I have been given, and it is a very heavily upgraded version of the Gazella GT. It's a nice car all around, as you can see there, and uh, there's so many stars, to say the least. We can probably get a fully upgraded one eventually. Maybe I can drop a video on that at some point, but uh, I just want to do an initial gameplay for this. Now, there is an event that has come open with this Hot Wheels uh, brand new vehicle. If I go into it now, it should be on the car series. If I quickly take a look, uh, let's have a look, see. Uh, there it is. It's the car series known as the Diecast Dynamos. And these Diecast Dynamos applies to the Hot Wheels Time of Taxi, which is the other vehicle as part of this update, and the Hot Wheels Gazella GT. Now, it's 50 gold series reward for completing the entire thing. And uh, for every chapter, by the looks of things, it's around 10 gold as well. So we're going to do it. We're going to see if we can do the first five events. That's going to be my gameplay for today. I just want to try out this car and see what it's like. I'm pretty excited to try it out. And uh, we actually get Rush Out as our first event with 2,500 currency and 100 rep. Let's get straight into it. Hot Wheels Gazella GT is what we're going for. Now, the race is easy. I'm hoping to go through all of these without actually messing up. But, uh, you know, I... I it's, it might be a bit of a hit and miss scenario. But as you can see there, we've got PR that is at least 200 more than our other racers. So for us to somehow mess this up, it would uh, it would it, it would be quite it would be quite an achievement, I think, really. So let's see what we can do here. Now, if you guys watched my first ever episode on this update, I over revved it really badly. So I'm gonna try not to do that. There you go, perfect launch there, and. Uh, Look at that. I don't even need to slipstream. I'm just darting through all of them like they're not even there. Let's do some drifting. Let's see what the car can do. Look at that. It just it is it's definitely one of the best design cars. I I I never really used Hot Wheels when I was younger, but uh, I know sort of the wacky designs they brought out. I remember there was a Hot Wheels collaboration with Rocket League recently. So uh that's pretty interesting. I haven't even played Rocket League in ages either, but I know Hot Wheels are known for their wacky cars they bring out and uh it's, it's crazy. This this car, as you see there, how quickly did we go through that first one? There was no competition there. We beat everyone by just under about 10 seconds there. That's ridiculous. I generally didn't have to do anything in order to get in front of everyone. And uh, there you go. 2,500 cash is what we got. Event 1, piece of cake. Especially with this car, it's, it's unbelievable. And uh, Event 2 is a time trial. We're going to jump straight into this. Honestly, guys... I'm amazed at how quickly I did that. So, uh, yeah, it's it, it's a great car. I, I know it's only from Event 1 that I'm saying that, but the, the speed is flat out. Like, it's ridiculous. The handling is ridiculous. I haven't tried out the timer taxi currently at the time of recording this, like the proper timer taxi, which is the other vehicle as part of this update. But uh, I did expect the, the uh, Gazella to be slightly, slightly better, to say the least. So maybe that's going to keep my hopes up. Let's see if we can do some drift fire. There you go. Let's keep going. I hope there's an airborne trial. I didn't I didn't actually properly look. Maybe there's going to be an airborne trial that we can do this with as well. I don't even need to use the nitro. That's that's how crazy it is. Oh, I've made a right mess up there. Though. I wasn't paying attention. But look, it, it's such a quick car that I made a mess up and I still I still didn't even fail. It this is crazy. 
Okay, we got our rep up there, but that's not really uh, not really mean anything to us. There you go, 2,500 gold. Uh, um, cash, actually, that's what we got. Event free. Oh, we got a real racing advert there. <laughs> there you go, airborne. Okay, sweet. So we actually do have an airborne one to do. These are my favourite events. I love the airborne events out of all of them. And uh, it's on Harbour Town Rush. And our PR, again, is 200 more than everyone else. It, it's Honestly, it's just ridiculous. Let's have a look. I'm not going to try and over rev it. Let's, let's see if we can get perfect again. There you go. We did just about there. I was getting a bit worried. I didn't think we were going to do it. But look, I don't even need to slipstream anyone. I'm just going to stay in my own lane. Ah, oh, and first place has sort of got in my way there. Yep. Uh, let's spin around there. Now we shoot off. There you go. Look at that. Look at that. We've taken the lead. Everybody else is miles behind us. I'm struggling there. I was I was about to say I'm really struggling trying to handle the drifting and then with the nitro and that. There you go, the corners. Take this correctly and we should be all good. There you go. Come around this corner, hit that. That's a bad idea. That was a bad one to hit if I do say so myself. And there you go. This car, guys, I, I, I generally don't know what to say. If this is not enough showcasing for you for how good this car really is, I don't know what, what else to do. I, I can't believe how quickly I'm smashing through this. It is day one, so you you got to take that into account. It's only day one, so it is on easy. So it shouldn't be that hard, but I'm guessing as you go through the chapters, and there is five chapters in this, it's going to get progressively harder. That is the general idea, but this car, I just, I, I just don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. It's too good. It's too good. Right, supercharging nitro, okay. I'm not very good at these. It is the nitro rush event. It, it's, it all depends on how I take my corners. Like, with this, oh, blooming hell, with this car, it's just, everything's going way too quickly for me. Oh, my. Oh, my. Oh, my, oh, my, oh, my. Oh, wow. <laughs> See what I mean? How quickly did that just happen? Like, we hit seven nitro zones there. Got 765 total earnings. And uh, we beat our time by 3.63 seconds. That was just so quick. It's unbelievable how quick that was. Again, we're going, we're shooting up our rep levels at the moment. Like It's going so quickly through. It's a shame I can't upgrade the car with what I'm getting. I actually, no, I should be able to. Let's, let's, let's quickly go to the garage before we do that. See if we can do any upgrades to this car. Let's have a look. Uh, da -da -da. At the moment, I don't think we can. No. Uh, campaign. Campaign. Tune tutorials. Let's, let's have a quick look at what, at what applies to each stuff. Campaign. Campaign. Tune trials. So you can install it. Oh, wow. Blimey now. The ins to like install stuff to this car is very 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 expensive so you can tell that i've got a fully like a fully upgraded version in a way it's not completely upgraded but you can see how much damage the upgrade has really done to that car to make it such an animal let's go through to event five i can't believe it how how good this car is honestly like i've used the uh the previous ones from the little wayne update the BMW, and I've got the other name of the other one off the top of my head. But I used them cars, and they were crazy good. But this, this, this takes the cake, to say the least. So we need to catch up and win. We're playing Hunter for our final event. Let's see if we can do it. Look at how quickly we've caught up with him. Look, he's gone. He's out of the picture already. It's all about us now. Look at how quickly we've done this. Like, generally, we, we caught up with him in a matter of seconds. It wasn't even a struggle. There you go. Look at that. Look at how quickly we've done that, guys. That is ridiculous. Simple as that. Job done. We beat him. And there you go. Our rep goes up again there. And we get ourselves some more currency. What can I say about the Gazella GT, guys? Chapter complete. We get ourselves some gold. This car is amazing. Honestly, if I could somehow do... A completely upgraded version, which I can't do at the moment. I'd love to do it. I'd love to see 
how much damage we can do with a fully upgraded Hot Wheels Gazella GT. But this is from the new update, guys. If you haven't already checked it out, or you're seeing this before the full release of the actual update, then uh, just get prepared for it because this is an amazing car to say the least. If you guys are new to Need for Speed and you want to see more type of content on my channel, recommend checking out, subscribing for future content like this. And uh, yeah, definitely go and check out the game, download it for yourselves. That car is ridiculous. And I'll catch you guys as always in the next video.